You know what? Every time he talks, he's in air quotes. Everything is ironic. To yeah, him. and and the thing is, I I find that 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 style of humor gets a little tiresome because it's 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 pretending to be risky, but it's actually playing it safe because you can disown anything that doesn't work. You can say, "Oh, I told you that was going to be a bad joke." Right. Um, but Ben Affleck, not do, do you know this? Ben Affleck and I went to the same summer camp. Different times, we didn't know each other. That's fascinating. We went to the same summer camp. You see, I, I knew you. I that knew, is I knew incredible. So. That, so that's, the, of all that's the Oscar my, trivia, that's my I've proximity heard to uh, how about to greatness, uh, how to about the luster of the Oscars. A little more broadly. Yes. He owned Hollywood at a very young age. One for screenplay. Yeah. Wrote an amazing film with yeah. Matt Damon. Yeah. Um, and then things didn't go so well for him. Well, he tried to be the kind of big movie star, and 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 he he was he was in some uh, some pretty bad uh, some stinkeroos. Uh, Daredevil. Um, what was that one? Reindeer Games. Remember that yeah. one? There's a big J Lo um, moment. Yeah, and there was Jiggly. Um, <laughs> however you say it, Jiggly. Uh, but he's a good filmmaker. You now know, he, he made he, three three great movies. Three right? good movies. He 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 takes it seriously. He's he's learned the craft and uh, um, and and I think it's an interesting kind of thing that happened in the narrative of this year's Oscars when the nominees came out when the nominations were announced on January 10th, and his name was not in the best director. Um, List, everyone thought, you know, well, that's it for Argo. You know, it's all, it's all going to be Lincoln. Best and break then, he ever had. In a funny way, yeah. Um, because he handled it graciously and with good humor. Um, As he always does. And also, people remembered, hey, I really like that movie, Argo. I mean, Argo op opened up a little before the others. You know, Plus, it was an I October really like that guy, that Ben Affleck guy. Yes. And, and this is, I mean, the Oscars are the film industry voting on its own. And it is a lot about. The sort of the the friendships and reputations and connections and sort of who you are to those people in that town, which um, is why Argo is going to win and Lincoln is not. I agree. I think that is. I think that is true. But you picked Lincoln. I didn't pick Lincoln. You picked Argo. I picked Argo for best picture. I I prefer Lincoln. We've discussed. Are we going to have to have the Lincoln? Let's just have fight it shortly. Again? It was long and a little boring. It was very moving and very um, and 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 very profound and I and and reached a level when you're thinking about the dramatization of historical reality. It reached a level of of thematic richness and emotional you know power it, that Argo did not. Argo is a much more. It's a very good movie. It's a very well mo made movie. It's an entertaining movie. It's a much more superficial, surface level, easy movie. You know what it reminded me a lot of? Which? Lincoln. What? The Oscars. Spending spending three hours with me? No. The Oscars. <laughs> three and a half hours. You know how it's going to end. You know what's going to happen. Yeah. And meanwhile, there are a lot of long, boring speeches in the middle of it. Lincoln, Oscars. <laughs> Same thing. <laughs>